Hi guys, it's Flores and a bit, and this is my second how to draw video. Uh, today we're gonna draw a uh, alien head, and I like this drawing because it's easy to make, it doesn't take much time, and it looks very cool. So, um, so as you can see, I've drawn a little sketch here over here, a little loose lines, and uh, to draw alien head, you start with uh, the head, the shape of the head. Um, an alien head is just a round, uh, just tilted oval with a, a square-like mouth beneath it. Uh, so we start with the uh, head, with the upside of the head and just draw a little bit like uh, oval thing. Oh no! <laughs> we just erase that. No, we we leave it there. I adjust this later. So you have a, a like this shaped head, and. Uh, on the front side, you make a little bump for the nose. Uh, because aliens don't have actual nose, I think, guess. Uh, you make um, just a little bump, and you make in the bump a nostril. Wait, wait, wait. It's too small. You can see it right. A nostril like that. Yeah, you can see it better. Sorry, my camera is not that good, but yeah. Um, when you have the head, more or less, you can start with the mouth. I choose for an open mouth, like it's screaming or it wants to eat you or with it. I don't know. But you can close it if you want to. One, two. And just. It's really square like this. And it's big. It's a normal big. It's not It's not realistic or something. Just a little bit, bit cartoony. Anime like. Manga. And not m manga. Oh, right, nah. Uh, well, you yeah, have the head and the head. Flows like this in the neck. A little bit smaller. A little eraser. And it just flows from the head in, into the neck. Uh, well, you have a little bit uh, like a sh shape of the head. I'm gonna make the mouth. The mouth is really, uh, yeah, also square. I don't know why, but I always draw it like this. And it's easy to make, and it's really quick, so it's nice. I'm gonna thicken it out. Yeah. Uh, now you have the contours of the head, but you want to have an eye. I've drawn a little sketch. And I'm gonna uh, draw an eye. Well, the front part of the eye is a little... There is a little bump, like this. And it's an angry alien, because aliens are angry. And just it looks similar to the eyes I've made on uh, my previous video. You can check it out if you want. It's on my channel. I described how you can make three sorts of eye. A little like this one, a more real and a cuter eye. I'm sorry about the background noise if you can hear it. Uh, yeah. Well, you have the shape of the eye now, 
and you uh, above the eye is a little bump like here this part sorry I'm centered in it and I don't know why but I think everyone have that like uh, well I'm gonna make the eye you can make a pupil like but then it's going to uh, look uh, a lot like my previous videos so I'm gonna make it black you leave a little line above, uh, below the upper eyelid, like that. You can see it. Wait, let me. I lift it up. You can. Nah, <laughs> you can see it. But you leave a little line between the dark side of the eye and that eyelid. So there's a little light between. Uh, wait, I'm gonna just show it. You can see it better. It's better to learn if you know what you're drawing. Like this? Nah, you s can still can't see it, but well. You leave a little line between that. And. You stop like this, three, three quarters, I guess. And you go back and there you make another like a W on the side and this W this area presents the light that comes in aliens have big black eyes I guess I don't know but yeah and this area I'm making it black I'm moving the paper to that side I don't know why excuse me for that and you make, make and you make it really dark wait I, I, I'm using a HB pencil but you can use a to uh, be you can thicken it out it's uh, easy to draw with different different pencils like H uh, H 2H or 4H 4H I'm not using that often because it's not uh, nice to draw it with it, it, it's really sharp and thin so you can make really uh, detailed lines but like HB this one no uh, 2B I'm sorry uh, you can make thick lines you can uh, you also can use it for coloring something in so yeah it's, it's nice to use different pencils your drawing can be uh, different you can you can make your drawing interesting I'm just lifting it up well you have a dark eye like that and you can well, wait I make a mistake mistake I'm sorry if you're drawing along it's like this go to there and then back it really doesn't matter actually you can make it like that or what I did but just feel free to add everything to your uh, drawing I'm moving a little bit uh, the paper also but the slow I'm drawing slow that normally doesn't happen to me very often uh, well I see that the neck is a little bit uh, wide um, so make it a little bit elegant because aliens are so elegant uh, yeah, <laughs> sorry. Um, well this eye you can uh, draw lines like this like it's a facet eye or something and you can draw like this 
By the way, I'm turning up my light because it's a little bit dark here. Maybe you can see it better. This. Uh, well, you have a little uh, line there. I'm sw switching to HB. Uh, well, you have more or less the eye now. And you can go further with the, uh, the bones of the head. So, it's, it's, it's supposed to be a scary alien. So, uh, if you make here a line, like this. You can... Is your cheekbone or something? I don't know much about uh, anatomy. But, yeah. Um... I see a lot of but yeah. Uh yeah. <laughs> see. And you you see it's giving a little bit uh you can see the bones of the structure of the head. I'm thinning this in it's a little bit big. I don't know if if I'd said it, it, but I'm Dutch, so my grammar and pronouncing of words can be a little bit uh, weird sounding. But I'm just trying my best. Uh, just making this. Maybe, by the way, maybe I'm gonna do a time lapse video. Because these are tutorials you can draw along with. But maybe you're interesting. In uh, sorry guys, my, my camera just stopped. I don't know why. But we continue. Um, well, you have your head like this. And you make... Uh, like a C shape. Something. Behind the eye. Just a... a the bone you can see through the skin of the alien. And yeah, Ooh, camera shifted. Well, wait, is my camera? Wait, yes, that's better. Sorry. Um, yeah, uh, you can make a little line beneath the eye, underneath, beneath. I don't know, but it doesn't matter. It's like he's tired. Look like a wrinkly. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, and then you uh, you can just start a l with a, a teeth. So teeth. Sorry, uh, these are just triangle shaped like this. It's, it's just not that hard. You can do it like this. Just a little bit. Ooh, that's a little. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you can perfect perfect them if you want to have to run it. It's a it's a movement. You can it's really easy. You can look like this. Doesn't matter. The the result result is ooh, it's a little bit small. Result is the same. You can do it however you want. However you, however you want to draw teeth. You can make them bigger. That mostly make them scarier. And you go smaller, you can draw them smaller if you want to. If you want to make them cuter or less scary. Uh, well, you have a head and shape and you can adjust the shadow. You can add some shadow. I'm adjusting my light. This. It's not very... Wait. Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, fine. Um, you can make shadow. If you see this bump here, it if light is come from that angle, <laughs> from actual light, you can see this bump keeps some shadow. So what I'm gonna do is drawing here, been behind the bump of the eye, a little bit darker, like the shadow. You can also do this with a uh, with a two B pencil. But I'm just gonna stick to HB. A little bit thicker. 
I'm gonna speed a little bit up because my video is gonna be a bit, little bit long. Maybe I'm gonna time lapse another video, but just yeah. Uh, beneath this line, this wrinkle, you can make shadow. Also, you can make also shadow, and just like it pops out with a nose nostril a little bit shadow around it and just floating into the mouth everything can has a little bit color I'm doing that this with the gray black and white drawing but you can you can do the green or another color or something everything you like um, of course this bump has also a shadow but lighter you can make this darker and the shadow of the bump lighter you have contrast so you can see uh, better the drawing I'm just making this a little bit darker also here well yeah that area uh, this gap or uh, yeah I don't know bone structure you can uh, add some shadow here to let it pop out make here shadow also you can it depends where the light comes from you can make shadow just keep in mind if you uh, set the light from one angle you can't just going uh, make the shadow at another, another angle it could but it's a little bit weird looking well uh, you can see it very well on my camera maybe I'm, what am I going to adjust my camera uh, also shadow behind the cheekbone and in the back of the head here is a you leave a little gap between the shadow and the uh, contour of the head and no, I do that you can fill it in but I like it this way Oh, it's cold here. And this video is also taking quite a while. I'm turning the paper. If you turn the paper and your uh, pencil is going like this, if you do that, you can go with the head with adding editing some shadow. It's easier. You turn turn the paper and just go all around the back of the head to make shadow like this uh, then you make I, I've drawn the shadow a little bit light but I'm yeah you can make it darker it's easier to look it gives a little bit pop out of the painting of the drawing not the painting by the way, I'm not so good at painting, but drawing I like. Uh, you can give the teeth a little shadow, just going uh, all, all over them. All, all. Sorry, sorry, it's cold here. <laughs> um, also, this cheek can has a little shadow because it's deep in the face this under jaw and this neck I'm just doing a head today so if you want to uh, if you want me to see doing a whole body uh, leave it in the comments <laughs> like this 
Shadow is by the way hard to do, but if you practice you can achieve a nice shadow. Because practice and patience is one of the main things during drawing. During drawing. It's hard to say. Well I think that's uh uh Yes, that is uh uh ready well if you want to uh, if you like this video give us a thumbs up if you uh, had drawn this head uh, give a video response or something uh, yeah like it favorite if you favored it and leave in suggestions anything I can draw so I see you next time bye bye